Thank you for watching. Today we're going to talk about the eighth wonder of the world, the rule of 72 and how you can double your money and profit from the rule of 72. From Spain to Vancouver, BC and all points in between and beyond, you can find us here on the World Wide Web at wisdominvestor.com where we're cruising our way to financial independence, building a nest egg for retirement. We want to thank you for joining us here today. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button. You'll get more free videos just like this and others along the same subject of building a nest egg. And you can also hit the like button if you like the video. And if you'd like to leave a comment, you're welcome to leave a comment. Again, we're talking about the rule of 72 and how you can profit from it. Well, Albert Einstein was given credit for promoting this uh, powerful rule of compound interest. He says here, compound interest is the eighth wonder of the world. He who understands it, earns it. He who doesn't, pays it. Okay, we're going to take a look at what happens if you don't take advantage of the rule of 72? Either you're going to profit from it or somebody else is going to profit big from it. So why not let it be you? Okay, let's take a look here at the rule of 72 and why we need to understand the power of the rule of 72. In addition to you taking advantage of it versus the bank, we also have news that the Social Security is funded until 2034 and about three-fourths funded for the long term. Let's just go right to the Social Security website right here. Here's what they say right on their own website. Social Security funded until 2034, about three-quarters funded for the long term. And they go on to say here that there's going to have to be some options to address due to the long-term shortfall. If we don't adequately address the Social Security problems and issues going on, then in 2034 and beyond, it will only be funded for 70% 70, 70 of what the potential is. Let's go on and take a look at more information on Social Security the average Social Security benefit is $1,360 per month. There are many earning less than this. The maximum benefit is $2,639. If you'd like to increase your income when you retire, then it would be important to build a nest egg to supplement your Social Security income. The way our political climate is today, nobody wants to address the Social Security situation. The reason for that is it's going to require some changes. People are going to have to wait to an older age to retire. Nobody's going to like that. Any politician that pushes this out amongst the people is not going to get voted in or it will be used against them in an election. So nobody's going to talk about it. Uh, there may have to be more contributions put in. Nobody wants to talk about that. It is a t subject that's off the table because it's, it's a volatile situation. So you and I have to take care of our own situation and build additional monies beyond Social Security. And I know many of you are already doing that, and that is great. Again, pass this off to somebody else who may need some help and understanding the power of 72, the rule of 72. So let's get started here. 40, it's got some good news here. 43% of Americans now have at least $1,000 or more set aside versus only 31% last year. Uh, that's increasing. More people are saving. That's great. In fact, 25% of Americans now say that they have $10,000 or more in savings, which is an increase of 10 percentage points from 2016. So that is good news. Good news. We have in the 5,000 to 10,000 area, we have more people saving. In the 10,000 above, we have more people saving. Now, the shortfall is here, percent with less than 1,000, still at 57%. That's a lot of folks. They need help. And that's what we're here to do is, is spread the good news about the rule of 72. 
So how much money do you have if you're a millennial, 25 to 34? Good news. We're seeing more savings, increased savings, 10,000 above, 20% bad news, 41% have zero. Less than 1,000, 20%, 61% have less than 1,000 to zero. Uh, generation Xers, 35 to 44, 10,000 above, it's increasing. That's good news. On the opposite side, we still have 38% with zero and 16 with, with less than that. So 50% um, or more. Baby boomers, increased savings is increasing, 32% now above 10,000. 0%, we have 33%, and less than 1,000, another 16%. Seniors, we see the seniors saving more money because they understand what it's all about when you're retiring. You need to have some extra money. You can't just rely on Social Security. But the unfortunate thing is we still have 32% with 0%. 14% less than a thousand. That's a lot of folks that are that need more money. Uh, more than half Americans will retire broke. 14% estimate have $300,000 in retirement investments, uh, dollars saved for retirement. That 300,000 is is a nice number. I'll show you in a minute how far that will go. Uh, 34 percent have I don't have retirement savings less than 10,000 21 percent so we're talking 54 percent don't have hardly anything so the rule of 72 is here to help you build your retirement savings to double your money so what is, how does this rule of 72 work this is calculated by dividing 72 by your interest rate that you're getting for example 72 you're getting four percent that means 18 years your money's going to double. It takes 18 years. Here's a an example, big picture here of what the rule of 72 can do. Interest rate at 4%, we said 18%, 6% doubles in 12 years. Uh, if you get a higher return, like 12%, will double in six years. So the higher return you can get, the faster it's going to grow. Keep in mind too, the higher the interest rate, the more risk that's involved. But we're going to we show people on our website here if you are going to take more risk how to protect yourself from loss rule number one is you want to limit eliminate losses okay example number one here's a 30 year old who has ten thousand dollars to invest he's going to earn he or she's going to earn four percent in the bank now what are banks paying today not even close Here's 1.35, 1.2, 1.3, 1.2. This is just an example if uh, we could get 4%. Uh, the test for today for you out there, if you're only getting 1%, how fast will your money double? How many years will it take for your money to double? We'll come up with the answer at the end. 30-year-old starts with 10,000, doubles to 20 at 48. 40,000 at 60 at 66. Okay, that's not a bad little amount of money, but it's not going to go very far to supplement Social Security. Example two, let's say you're much smarter now after you listen to our website here at wisdominvestor.com about the rule of 72. 30 year old has 10,000 and gets 8% return using the S&P 500. Just to let you know that's a oh, since inception, the S&P 500 has averaged over 9%. I'm using 8% here. It can fluctuate. There can be years that it will be higher. Other years it will be lower. Here's the S&P 500. Uh, what it invests in. Stocks like Apple, Microsoft, Facebook. It's the top 500 companies in the U.S. AT&T, Chevron, and it's diversified. And it's uh, relatively, uh, I don't want to say safe necessarily, but a a bona fide uh, investment vehicle that is uh, familiar with almost everyone. And what is the S&P 500 uh, earned over the years? Let's just take a look here. In the recent years, year to date, 13.18, one year, 17.8. So we've had some good moves in the market here. A three year, 10.03, five year, 13.63, 10 year, 7.3. We had a a dip in the markets back, but in the last five years, it's been pretty strong. 
in the last one year. So the S&P 500 using this and just saying 8% for the long run, here's what you can do. 30 year old starts with 10,000, it doubles to 20, 40, 80, 160. By the age of 68, $320,000 to supplement Social Security. <clears throat> How much are banks paying today? 1% or less. This will take 72 years to double. I said just a minute ago, that was our test question. 1% will take 72 years. So you've got to earn more on your money. Let's say now you're even smarter using the rule of 72, $10,000 investment. You want to get 12% return. Turn. You're going to use an aggressive mutual fund. Again, we can't guarantee uh, what a fund will do, but here's an example of a fund. This is Fidelity Select uh, uh, software and IT services. All your major companies uh, are managed or part of this fund here. It's a, it's a managed fund. Year to date, 26%. One year, 23.42. Three year, 17.47. Five year, 19.7. So it can be done. I'm showing you ways of where it can be done. And the question is, is, is how are you going to do it? And that's what we show people. We educate people how to take advantage of the markets, be in the market at the right time and out of the market when it's going down to preserve your assets. Example five, uh, let's say a person cannot come up with $10,000. They have 1,000 to start with. They're gonna earn 8%. They're gonna use the S&P 500 over the next 30 years or more and they're gonna invest $100 per month. They can come up with $100 a month to invest. They would grow to $160,000, and that's not bad compared to what it would be if you did nothing and tried to survive off of Social Security. Uh, using an example here, let's be a little more, uh, <clears throat> well, let's say you can save a little bit more. Again, $1,000 to start, 8% S&P 500, 400 per month for 30 years, that would grow to $600,000. Now that's $400 per month starting with 1,000. So there are ways to build your retirement or even may, you may have to use some of those funds along the way, emergency comes up. At least you'll have some money to take advantage for your own personal situation. Create personal wealth for your own family, create critical mass so that you can work when you want to or stop working whenever you choose. Again, you can find us at wisdominvestor.com. We have been talking about how to double your money with the rule of 72 and how compound interest works as the eighth wonder of the world. Subscribe to the videos if you'd like to receive more. Hit the like button if you like it. And leave a comment if you'd like to leave a comment. Thank you for watching.